Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel and today we are going to be going to the pop-up store where last year I bought about six shirts but yeah, uh, last year we bought six shirts I'm not gonna buy as much today I'll just be buying probably one shirt because I don't have a big budget it will be about 100 euros so we won't buy anything like what I'm wearing now but it will be fun, it will be fun uh, it's the special football shirts pop-up store. They do one every year. It's in the middle of Amsterdam, so it will be busy. It's currently Wednesday, so I hope it's Wednesday morning. Actually, it's Wednesday. It's 10:30 a.m. So I hope it won't be that busy, but it probably will. I don't even know if you can hear this intro, but let's get straight to this. So last year, there were a lot of customers which made a big waiting line outside. So I hope it isn't this ca the case this year. It would mean good business and I do. I would give them that, but please let the people come after like 12, please. It's a good thing because I can't see anyone yet. But it does mean that it, there is a possibility that I could just feel normally there instead of quickly so that no one's face gets in the frame.
I spent about twice my budget. We'll just have to eat crumbs for the rest of the month. So like I said, um, I won't be uh, going back to the store because I just simply don't have any money left. Um, but I'll show you the kids in a couple of seconds. Look at this. Amsterdam is gorgeous today. It's gonna be a hot day, that's why I've taken off my jacket. Let's flag and go. I'll show you the shirts when I'm home. So, I got myself quite a few things. Like I said, the original plan was going to be uh, me just getting <clears throat> 100 euros worth. I doubled it. Yeah, and we're gonna start off with the most important part this is honestly the best part of the entire thing it's stickers i got stickers yes basically if you didn't know yet um behind this uh all these shirts like i still need to get a new racket for shirts uh, but behind that i actually got a lot of stickers and i got a few i took a few home for uh, which is has great art from Pyro. Uh, I met the guy himself, the guy that made these stickers. I met him, and I love this. I love this artwork. I didn't even know he was coming to the store. I just loved it. With all the Netherlands, with a couple of Netherlands legends and their football shirts, I got a few of those. And I also bought another thing that has to do with Pyro, that was available in the store. It's this really cool Ajax Legends uh, sweater. It has nothing on the back, but this is genuinely so sick. Like, look at all the, look, you got all these Ajax icons. You got, is, is that all the worlds? <laughs> Tadic. Jacques Swart, Rijkaard. Suarez. All these amazing players with a couple of really cool Ajax shirts. Um, so yeah, I had to get this. Like I saw it hanging there. I love the artwork from Pyro and I, I just have to say that I love this shirt, like this design. I just think this is so cool and I don't really have a lot of sweaters. So this is fun. I mean, it isn't a football shirt, which is why you're here, but this is where you've all been waiting for. This is honestly so fucking sick. I got myself a Barcelona shirt from the 90s. And not just any Barca shirt. This shirt itself is also really sick, by the way. I really like it. It has someone on the back. <laughs> Luis Figo. I genuinely thought that all the Barcelona Luis Figo shirts had been destroyed by Barca fans. But this one hadn't. And oh my god. I love Figo as a player, by the way. But I'm not a Barca or Real Madrid fan. From those two, I do enjoy Barca more, but I don't enjoy him enough to hate Figo. So this shirt itself is really fucking sick. And the fact that Figo's on the back as well just makes it perfect for me. Um, 
But that's the only shirt I bought and I'm gonna try it on now. Ah, <laughs> look at this man. Oh, it fits so good. And it looks like, I usually don't say this, but I think this just looks so good on me. I love the color. Oh, I love this shirt. Uh, I was in the shop for about a half, under half, what? Uh, about an hour and a half. And I just couldn't find anything. And because today was the only day that I actually had time to go to the shop, uh, I just felt like I needed a football shirt to go home with. And before I went, I was actually thinking of only buying the sweater. Uh, but then the girlfriend of the one that the guy that like is the owner of the store uh, actually told me like is asked the owner like isn't there anything in his size uh, behind the scenes so he went behind the scenes and he said yeah we have these these are a few uh, extra larges from the 90s and I saw the word Barca and I thought could be so expensive could be really expensive but I paid 120 euros for this and I think the fact that it has Figo oh the fact that it has Figo on the back as well is so good like this has genuinely become one of my new favorite shirts of all time just because I mean look how good it, lo it looks so good on me and I am I don't like to say that I'm a handsome fella because I don't think I am but God, it looks gorgeous on me. Oh, it just fits. It just fits. And as you can tell, like in the background, there is a Barcelona shirt now. This is my fourth Barca shirt in the collection uh, because I do also have a training top. When I was younger, I used to have a lot of Barcelona shirts, but I don't have them anymore. So I don't count them. But yeah, this is just a gorgeous shirt. I love it. So please go to the special football shirts pop up. It's in Amsterdam. If you're from the Netherlands, it's really easy to get to. It's a 20 minute walk from Central Station. You can also take a tram there, uh, which is also fine, but I usually like to walk there. So yeah, please go there. I'll leave a link to their site in the description down below. There won't be anything on there now because there, it's all of it is in the store. Uh, but yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you guys around in a bit. Bye.